And just to give some perspective to it, like in 1999, 2000, when we first opened, we were doing on the weekends, 200 rounds a day, and we were getting on average uh, about $100 per round. And that was great. And then a couple of things happened in 2007, 2008, when the housing crisis happened. But that's right around when pure capitalism came into play. And that's with golf now. And, you know, it's a great thing. But I was at the same time, I was a victim of it because here it is where somebody built a better mousetrap. Golf now comes along and now you've got tof.com and a number of other ones where they aggregated all that information into one spot. So now you have these golfers that at their fingertips can compare prices and can go look at what tee you know, sheets are available and what tee times. And you had a lot of golf courses, I think, that also at that point in time were suffering from being overbuilt. So you had a lot of guys that I think felt that one of their only ways to try and make it was to drop their prices. And so the cost of a round of golf dropped precipitously around that time because now everybody's competing and the, the winner was the golfer.